So here we got a 466. Do the uh, fuel rate adjustment. I already got the cap off, which takes a uh, 3 8 or 10 millimeter Allen head. This particular one takes a 3 8 deep socket to bust the, the the nut on the bolt, the adjustment bolt loose. Just get it just enough to loosen up. And you get your socket off of the wrench and sneak your screwdriver down in there so you don't lose the nut. And then you screw it out. Then snug your nut back up. And get your ratchet back. Tighten it up. That's pretty much it. Can't really see the screw, but it screws down in there. And if it gets too smoky, or if you go too far, you can get it caught up under the little lip there, and then your RPM will hang up, and it won't be able to shut it off. So make sure you don't get it up too high. Run it. Make sure that it's not going to go too far. And then if it's too smoky, your star wheel's down inside here. That takes a 8mm or a 5 sixteenths Allen. Uh, you can spin that towards the front for more smoke, or towards the back for less. And if all else, there's a nut on the back here with a, with a long bolt. You can adjust the preload that's on this spring to where you can get more or less smoke on the bottom end. That's pretty much the simple fuel rate trick.